right, let's see what we got. What is his uh, moveset going to be like? The only thing I really remember of actually playing Rugal in uh, some of these older games is like this crazy busted versions. So I'm a little curious how they're making him now. The so Repukin. Uh, that's zip through. Definitely not as fast as the boss variation. Uh... Cool! Damn, Genocide Cutter looks great. Does he have any good hit confirms? Certainly does. Oh my god, okay. See a super. If you do his close heavy and do uh, first command normal kick, he has a combo in eye laser and I think his far light kick. Yeah. Pretty much that. No. Oh god. Uh, after big genocide cutter, can I get anything? Hmm. EX Barrier, EX Rush, EX Genocide. Woo wee. Well, that's kind of cool. He seems a little nuanced, right? He definitely doesn't have all the, the crazy shit. I don't think he's immediately going to be banned in Mexico is what I'm trying to say. It doesn't come across as a character that is going to do that. Yeah, his Shatter Strike seems damn good. Like, right? Not bad. Oh, that's actually kind of neat. If you do this one, uh, he does like the uh, the whole Devil Jin follow up. That's sort of cool. Does this jump D have a long startup? Yes, as is probably traditional, right? The fishnets are crucial to the plot. Yes, him having fishnets are very crucial to the plot. Okay. Quick mode after this, the linked LK. Uh. Yeah, that's not bad. Oh, no, it doesn't hit. Uh, can he do genocide into genocide? No. No, he doesn't get anything crazy like that. He's definitely not a, it doesn't feel immediately like a boss character, you know? Do heavy genocide, right? Yeah, I'm not I'm not writing them off immediately. There's something here. It's not it's not super easy though, right? Which isn't gonna make him. It's, which is likely not gonna make him good because most of like the really good characters get away with shit because it's easy and good, right? But you know, there is some stuff here. He's not like a super basic bitch. <laughs> Yeah, that works too, right? That's pretty good. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Getting a little crazy. It's starting to get a little crazy. Oof. Oof. Now let's get the big one, right? God damn. Fuck. It's not insta death, but you know, fuck.
Not the craziest of shit, but just the fact that he can do that is nuts. I can definitely get 100%. 100% isn't the issue. I'm trying to figure out, like, what leads to what. I think I can even add a Shatter Strike in here. So, funny enough, I think this could actually work in the corner. So check this out. There we go. Will this maybe kill? No, it didn't. Oh, shit. It didn't end up killing. Oh, God. Damn, that's a lot of damage. Oh yeah, he's dead now. I'm pretty sure. Jesus! He's still alive! The bitch is still alive! He just refuses to die. I don't know if he immediately gives me like Gato levels of fuck, right? We're here like playing Gato and even the first few seconds you're like, wait a minute, this bitch can do what? Like, what? Huh? Is he mid or anchor? I don't know. I'd have to see how people that are much more versed in KOF play him. But he is cool. I'm glad that he's not... I'm actually kind of glad that he's not super OP. They, they, they did put some consideration into him. Where he's essentially like a... Sort of like an expert character. Maybe how like Angel sort of is, you know? Let's call it at that chat. Yeah. It, uh... We got some interesting stuff tonight. Matchmaking is still broken, unfortunately. But I do want to dedicate a bunch of time just to like relearning and... Figuring out a new character and sticking him on a team and just going for broke. So, should be fun.